Rice water for hair. We should use it or not? If yes, then how often we should use it and who should avoid using rice water on hair? How to use it? What is the best way to use it? All these questions I will try to answer in this video. Hi, my name is Dr. Vivek Joshi and welcome to my YouTube channel. First, is it safe to use on hair? Yes, it is safe to use on hair. Even dermatologists also have no problems with the use of rice water on hair. Rice water is safe. It's actually healthy for hair. Now, what are the effects that we can expect by the use of rice water? It can repair your hair. It can reduce the fizziness or the dryness from your hair. It reduces the surface friction, improves hair elasticity. It is one of the best hair tonic and you can make it easily at home this is the beauty of this rice water why it has so many effects because it has 75 percent of starch in it 15 to 20 amino acids in it it has a component called inositol in it which helps to give all these benefits to our hair so because of this inositol and more of the starch in it it helps to improve the elasticity can stop the damage of the hair now how to make this rice water i will tell you three ways first is the most simplest one just take rice put it in a pan put water to it put two times more water than how much is required to cook a perfect rice for example if you use one cup of rice and one and a half cup of water to cook rice in your daily life then you should add three cup of rice when you are making rice water for your hair just cook it cook it in a pan don't cook it in a pressure cooker just cook it in a simple pan and as your rice is ready to be eaten just filter this and the water that you got this is rice water that you can use your rice is cooked and your water is ready you can eat your rice and you can wash your hair so it is the most convenient way to use rice water now let's talk about the second way to use rice water for this just take one cup of rice add two cup of water to it and first also over here also i forgot to mention that before use wash your rice even just one time will be sufficient but wash your rice so over here also washing rice is mandatory after washing the rice take this one cup washed rice add two cups of water to it just shake it a bit and after this keep it for two hours after two hours just filter this water and here is your water ready to be used the third and the most effective one but not the most convenient one this is to ferment rice water we have to do all the steps same as we have done in the second way how to make rice water it's taking one cup of rice adding two cups of water to it mixing and keeping it not for two hours now we'll keep it for 12 hours to 24 hours now how we can decide the time the time will be same as it takes for curd to get ready if you make curd at home or yogurt at home the time that it takes to get the curd or the yogurt from the milk when you keep it for fermentation for exact same time you have to keep this rice water for example you can do it in the daytime and then next day in the morning you can use this rice water this is an example so decide according to the climate where you are living even if there is a little bit more fermentation nothing bad is going to happen it's good actually so see as you are comfortable what will happen is if there will be fermentation in the rice water this is going to be very beneficial for your scalp health because now this rice water has good bacteria in it plus it has good ph also so this rice water is going to add good bacteria to your scalp skin that is needed if your scalp will not have good bacteria then you will suffer from dandruff or itchy scalp or other kinds of scalp related issues and if you don't want dandruff and other issues the ph should be maintained so in both of these things use of rice water this fermented rice water is going to help you so that's why the best is to use fermented rice water how to use it you can use it after shampoo as a conditioner also just take the rice water massage over your scalp apply it all over the length of your hair keep it for 20 to 30 minutes and after 30 minutes you can rinse it off that's it this is how you use rice water you can try all the three method and see with which method you got best results 
let us also know in the comments box down below because maybe your experience will be helpful for others also so do share your feedback after trying this simple rice water remedy that you are going to make at home now how often to use this you can use this rice water once in a week but if you have too dry hair, too much dry hair, too much curly hair, then use it after 15-20 days. Don't use it often if you have too much dry or too curly hair. All others, you can use it once in a week and that's going to be helpful for your hair. Remember, for good hair, you should have good levels of vitamin D3, iron, ferritin and hemoglobin in your body. Only applying rice water is not going to help you. I hope my message is clear. I hope this video will be helpful for you. And at last, just want to remind you about my website. That's reherbal.in where we have launched a body lotion that has sun protection in it as well as works as a body lotion. It's actually a body lotion with sun protection in it and that too without artificial chemicals without artificial fragrance and without artificial colors if you are interested link will be in the description box down below see you next video with a big smile up to the time smile more stay happy stay healthy